Hello, kings, queens, and in-betweens, and we are back here to talk about one of the shows that is currently airing on the fall 2023 anime season. If you're looking for a show that looks like it was a JRPG on PS1, then we have the perfect show for you, and that is Let Me Check the Walkthrough First. Yes. Yes, I am joined by Elaine. I didn't introduce her, but I'm, I'm mostly joined by Elaine most of the time. So you can just assume that most of the time, unless you don't hear her talking, then I'm not. Wow. What do you think about this anime? I think this anime is not the most attractive anime to look at. To me, it looks like early stage Genshin Impact. Like before they refined their art style, they're like, this, this is the direction we want to go. And then just stopped production i'm not a big fan of genshin impact but i think that's insulting to genshin impact i think genshin impact looks a lot better than this does. well that's why i said early stage like they just ran out of money they're like whoops artists are expensive now and just like stop production there was a scene that had a bunch of wolves in it and the wolves were ugly and then there was a big wolf and the big wolf was ugly well it was basically like a monster version of the little wolves like it had a bunch of steroids and then became big the only so thing that surprising. i the only thing that i kind of find interesting about this is that the protagonist is 30 years old and and I appreciate when they put 30 year old protagonists and things because it makes me not feel super old. Well, that's true. We do watch a lot with like high school students. Yeah, it's always high school students or elementary school students or younger. But we've only watched one episode of this anime, but I don't think this is going to be an anime that we're going to be continue watching because there's really nothing in here that shakes up the isekai formula because she didn't get murdered by truck hoon. She fell off her balcony. She got murdered by ground coon. <laughs> she did. Yes. She splatted into the ground and was no more. And so she got isekai Yeah, that was something um, that was a little bit unique is ground coon killed her instead of vending machine coon or truck coon or stabby coon. Well, in those cases, the characters also hit the ground. So it was really ground coon and the other thing coon. Yeah. Though I feel like normally if you get killed by truck coon, the truck is the thing that kills you, not the ground. <laughs> So you're already dead when you hit the ground, but the ground yeah. finishes you off. It's like, I did one point of damage. Yeah. Uh, and uh, the stabby coon, when he kills you, uh, you, you die by the stabby, not by the ground. No, no. The ground does one point of damage on impact okay, and that finishes the, you off. That's the final point. Yeah. yeah. So in this one, the she was summoned by mistake it seems and she doesn't want to make it easy on herself so she rejects all of the the super broken skills which are actually referred to as the list of broken skills and she's like you know i would i just want the grind i want to play the game I, you know i've been working for this exploitative company which apparently every company in japan is an exploitative company naturally yeah and she just wants to play games because that's what she likes to do but i don't think there's enough here to make me want to continue watching the show no but she does run into the hero in the first episode yeah and then she's supposed to train her so she's actually a hero but i don't know yeah there, there's not really much that's uh intriguing the first villain is kind of very first level boss so Basic i guess it kind of makes sense yeah it, she's a, a chick with a bunch of wolves who can turn into a wolf yeah because she got a whip beast kin or something it, be, oh. she's a descendant of the beast men same thing which beast are the, kin, beast the men. strongest species on the planet i have to say though they had some cool designs like in the beginning with the tomato dragon like his entire body looked like a tomato his mouth looked like the inside of a tomato yeah that was that was something that was a little unique i like that but other than that this isn't anything special it's an isekai that looks like a very old-fashioned video game they have some of those like game boy overlays that kamikatsu had which gave me kamikatsu yeah flashbacks. it was like old like top down major like uh mini map style rpg kind of like, graphics yeah what well, you'd see in like an old game boy game. yeah and i mean they, they, i can see what they're going for i just don't think it's enough so i, I would i would give this a skip should you watch no Nah. Nah, brah. Something you shouldn't give a skip, though, is more of the Should You Watch content here on the channel. We're going to be going through what we can of the new 2023 fall anime season and giving you our first impressions when we first watch it. Yes. Sometimes it'll be one episode. Sometimes it'll be two episodes. Sometimes it'll be three episodes. It depends on how long it takes us to make these. Yes. <laughs> but you should check them all out. We'll try and keep them short for you so you know whether or not you should be wasting your time on these anime. We don't want to make them as long as the episode because then, you know, you might as well just watch the episode. But you also should watch us even if you watch the episode because we're amazing yes comment down below have you already started watching the content from the fall 2023 anime season subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of this content going forward and ring that bell so you know what's up and we'll catch you in the next one bye guys